Okay, here we are on this Labor Day weekend with our bold and the beautiful predictions, recaps, hopes. Okay. Welcome, Sylvia. Oh, hello, everybody. Hope you have a nice weekend. Right. Here we, well, here we go. Shall we start with the players? Yes, we can start with the players. Luna. What do you think of Luna? Don't even, don't even say her name to me. Don't even say her name. Don't even mention it. Worse than I can imagine. I mean, she's really something. The way she set up, trying to set up her mother. That's terrible. All right. I mean, and people thought she was bad, Poppy. Yeah. All yeah. right. Now, what do you think? Who do you think may be the one to rescue Steffi? The way I see it, we got, and tell me if you want to add anybody. I see several possibilities. Finn, Sheila, Ridge, Bill, anybody you want to add? That you yeah, think? Hope. Hope, you think she's a possibility? I have hope because it's hope. You have hope for hope. <laughs> right. <laughs> Maybe that'll make her get some kind of points with somebody. I don't know. I, I'm thinking it's Finn. The way yeah, he, it probably will be, but... The way they're doing the bit, the way she's looking at her ring and rubbing her ring and Finn helped me and, you know. Might be two people that help her. It might be. Yeah. I hope I'm, somebody helps her. I'm, trying, I'm thinking of how to get her out of there. I'm <laughs> hoping Sheila has something to do with it. What do you mean you hope she has something to do to with it? To rescue her. Oh, I don't know what she's talking about. I mean, Finn, maybe Finn should go to Mommy Dearest. I mean, he's got Lee, but Lee don't seem to be up on how to do that kind of stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, Sheila's probably right up on that. <laughs> yeah, or Deacon. If there's any way to unfasten that case, Sheila might know how to do it. <laughs> I just hope uh, Stephanie can get her hands on her for a few minutes. Right, I mean, what do you think, are they going to arrest her? Is she going to disappear into the sunset? Is she sure, gonna... she's going to disappear. They're going to think she burned up in the fire, but she'll come back. Right. Oh, yeah, because the house is being demolished. Yeah. She'll be back another time, just like Frosty the Snowman. Oh, I can't. Oh, I wish she wouldn't. Think of Frosty the Snowman. I could use some of that. I hand. know, right? Oh, God. I, I can none of you know we're over here in Florida doing this, and it's bad. It's bad. <laughs> um, what do you think? I'm, I'm trying to think how else could it play out. It's like they got Taylor there for some reason. I mean, of course, she always comes back. She always bounces back to Ridge. Yeah, I wish And not. Ridge, somebody ought to, you know, I don't know. I think she's had it. I think uh, what's-her-name's had enough of him. Brooke? Well, so yeah. far, they're still together. He hasn't done nothing yet. He will. He will, yeah. He always does, but she gets to blame. I know. You know, these women out there, I don't know if they're jealous of her or what, but they're always blaming Brooke. I know. It's ridiculous. Yeah, it is. Tell it to me. Oh, I don't like her at all. But I'm thinking now, she's a psychiatrist, I hope, well, a so-called psychiatrist, psychologist, whatever she is. I don't think she's very good at it myself, from different people she's treated. Like, I think, wasn't she treating Sheila at one time, I believe? She didn't help nothing. Not either. at all. Didn't help at all. No. <laughs> but <laughs> I wonder if she's going to be, like, talking to Luna. Oh, she is. Right. Yeah. I, I noticed on the previews, Finn told... Uh, Lee, that he can't help thinking Luna's behind it. Like, that's that he believes Steffi's in trouble, and he can't help, like, feeling that Luna is somehow part of it. Who said that? Finn did, on the coming attraction. Oh, Finn, yeah. I thought you meant Ridge. No, no, Finn did. Well, Finn, Ridge knows something's wrong. Because even though she wanted some uh, time away, she does usually check in or something. Yeah, for the kids, uh, yeah. Yeah, and even like RJ. And RJ's starting to know there's something with Luna. Yeah, so everybody thinks there's something with Luna. But doesn't, doesn't Bill think there's something with Luna when she's planting those lips on him? Right. And he just stays right there, doesn't he? You notice that? <laughs> yeah, I mean, he tells her no, but yeah, I would... But after the fact. I mean, I would think throw her the heck out by now. After the second time, throw her out. Especially, I don't know if you noticed, Finn kind of gave a few weird looks. The way she's walking around all happy. Like, she's so upset about the mother, but she's smiling. She wants to go for a swim. Yeah. Asking Bill if he wants to go with her. And Finn's kind of doing a double take there. You, know? <laughs> you didn't see that part? No. Yeah, she came out. 
And she said she wanted to go for uh, a swim, and she asked Bill if he wanted to come with her. And it's like, it's just, you know, your mother's in jail, there's people dead, and you're all happy and smiling, you want to go for a swim on the beach or whatever. I didn't, I didn't hear that. Yeah, maybe you were doing something, but yeah. I'd say when Finn was there, and she asked the asshole to go up and help her with the, in, in her room. The, the television. Yeah. Well, Finn looked a little strange about that, too. I think because, like, she's so worried about TV and everything, you know. Yeah. But, yeah, I, I don't remember. I think it was after that. Oh, I'm not sure. I, I think it was that. after that. But it was like, you know, she's cool. <laughs> yeah, I know. How and then she goes in there and tells them it was her mother. I know. But her I think, confessed. I think from, from what I remember, I don't think that cop, I can't think of his name, but I don't think he's stupid. And he looks a little bit puzzled to me. No, he's not. Stupid. Like he looked a little surprised. Like, yeah. you know, I don't know. It, it's going to be interesting. Now it only takes a second for them to get her out, and that's the end of that. Yeah, but then the we one, go into something else, Ridge and Brook. Yeah, the one thing though, and I know some other people have mentioned that they didn't do anything to do with the potty situation, but they don't even mention her not having a bathroom. Well, no, they're not going to mention that. Use your imagination. Well, where's she going? <laughs> I told you, she's not eating very much. Why would she be going? She hasn't drank anything. The show uh, isn't about where she's going to go to the bathroom. Who cares? They can't show her going to the bathroom. Come on. No, but it's just stupid that they got her in this little cage. And, I mean, how long is it going to be? Well, you know, the camera didn't really go across the the whole floor of the cage. Well, she's laying on it, sleeping. Well, don't worry about it. As long <laughs> as it ain't you. I mean, I'm hoping it means that they're not going to have her in there too long. You know what I mean? Like, hopefully this week they'll, she'll be rescued. She will be. Think so? Yeah. And how do you see it playing out? Well, she'll be dehydrated and everything, so it'll take her a week or two to recover. Yeah. Meanwhile, Ridge and his uh, ex-wife will be together. Oh, yeah, they'll be so upset about what happened to her, and they'll be, like, reuniting or something. Yeah, they'll reunite again. Well, maybe we need a new... If that happens, I mean, I like Ridge with Brooke, but if that happens, then I hope she doesn't keep going back with him anymore, because yeah, it's ridiculous. Yeah, back with him. It's ridiculous, but I don't see who who else are they going to put her with on the show. They're going to have to find somebody, somebody new. Somebody new. Finnegan? No. <laughs> Somebody short, not short and fat, like Ridge. Oh, you like Ridge, and you know it. Now no, on. he's too short and fat and doesn't know his ass from a hole in the ground. Oh, that's not nice. Now you're going to have Ridge fans after us. Hey, not many people's his fans anyway, so it doesn't matter. No, I like him on the show. I just hope he stays no, away from No, he's okay, but he's, he flip-flopped. Yeah. I thought, I heard they would bring him back. Uh, yeah, Dawn. Well, him I don't like at all. And not Why to be. You? I didn't like the attitude he had the last time he was there. Oh. He, he was so against Ridge with everything. I mean, I know Ridge had to say what happened with Eric and everything, but just to me, he was just a pain well, in the ass. Well, it's funny that Ridge isn't really Eric's son. Thorn is, and Thorn gets no say of anything. No, but I you mean, Eric's the one. Is? Eric's the one that picked Ridge, though. Well, I know that. I mean, but Ridge didn't do it. His feelings. Yeah, I just, I don't, he's too square. I don't care for him. No, but I heard why, I thought why it was coming back. Not no. that he'd be with Brooke, but I thought he was coming back, I read at one point. No, I don't think so. And what about Thomas? Is he coming back? Yeah, he's coming back because his mother's going to be living there. Oh, yeah. But I think he's coming back with a pregnant girl. But not the one he was supposed to marry. Really? I think so. Unless I dreamed it. You might have dreamed it, because I didn't hear that one. No, I didn't dream that. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, I did read that. Really? How could he be coming back with a pregnant girl? I don't know. He works fast. I guess. Well. He didn't work fast enough with Hope. I haven't seen Hope show. He tried. Yeah, I know. <laughs> over and over and over. <laughs> yeah, she's a, uh, I mean, okay, the, Stephanie is the main bit right now what's going on and it's interesting i never expected this with luna except for that one day long time ago when when you know brooke said about her you're so sweet and innocent 
Oh, I, I am. Yeah, yeah. I couldn't believe that. Oh, I am? I am. Yeah, yeah. Okay. RJ, she looks like she, I guess she don't like him at all. Yeah. It seems like. Not at all. Well, no, because he's not. I don't know. What's his name? I mean, well, like Stephanie said, he's got, she had a good job. He has the money. But I guess uh, Bill has more. Oh, I'm sure of that. <laughs> yeah. They call us uh, Poppy the gold digger. She's worse, I think. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh boy, what a crew. Yeah, but I was thinking what's nice. going to happen with... Uh, I have a feeling eventually he'll go, he'll go with Poppy. You think he's going to go back with Poppy? Yeah. Really? I keep thinking he's going to... I'm hoping he's going to end up with Katie. I don't think so, yeah. I think he's going to wind up. Although, I mean, really, she didn't do anything wrong. She tried him. She tried. Katie tried. He tried Katie for so long. Yeah. But I mean, won. I mean, I don't know what Poppy did. I mean. Over. So long. I don't know what Poppy did as far as. I mean, she didn't do nothing with the test. We know that was Luna. We know all that, but we don't have time. No, we're all right. Okay. Anyway, anything else you want to add? Not, not really, because I don't know. I, we know what's going to happen. Well, we got to try to see. I mean, I wonder what's going to end up with Hope. We didn't get to that yet. But we'll yeah, have to yeah, do it next I'm, time. I'm kind of tired of Hope. <laughs> She's a mental case. I don't know why Stephanie was blaming her. Finn to begin with, though. I mean, I know the bit okay. She did, He didn't stay away from her, whatever, but yeah. still. All right, I guess we better cut it off now. Our crew was telling us we're running out of time. Yes, I know. So we'll be back soon. Take care, everybody.